Let's look at the bonding in benzene. Now in benzene molecule, each carbon atom is sp2 hybridized. What does that mean? It means that each carbon atom has three equivalent sp2 orbitals and one p orbital, each containing, yes, one electron. Now every carbon atom forms two carbon carbon sigma bonds with neighboring carbon atoms and forms one sigma bond with each of the hydrogen atoms. Now, only the p orbitals are left. See carefully. Can you see? These p orbitals are parallel to each other and also they are perpendicular to the plane of the C ring. Now, you know, these p orbitals are close enough to overlap laterally and uh, thereafter form three pi bonds. Now, these bonds can be formed in two ways, as you can see. In reality, each p orbital overlaps laterally with p orbitals present on either side. Now, this gives rise to an electron cloud, both above the C ring and also below the C ring. Now, in benzene, the pi electrons are not bound. And uh, in effect, they can be present anywhere in this electron cloud. Hence, we can say that pi electrons in benzene are delocalized. 